Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Planet Nomads. And in my usual fashion, I'm up on the roof as, as per usual. But uh, I've been getting some stuff ready, uh, ready to go, uh, get ready to get a vehicle going. I'm going to do a little bit of exploring and try to get some cobalt at least so I can get a miner going. Because this uh, digging holes in the ground to get resources is absolutely terrible. Uh, but one of the things I want to do before we head off is I actually want to open uh, build the compact armory and see what I can get. I have been trying to get to the tech tree, but again, everything's held up by these conveyors. In order to do that, I need to build the refine the medium refinery, but that needs reinforced plating, uh, which, of course, I need the cobalt for. But anyways, let's go ahead and place this down and uh, see what this actually offers us. Because I wouldn't mind getting a better jet back and tool if I can. Uh, I need power. That's not power. And plug it in, plug it in. Sorry. Alright, so we can get the second tier jet pack. I can actually afford it, too. Uh, let's do this. May as well. And circuits. Alright, we'll craft that. And we need plating and mechanical parts. And three of those, which I need that and that. And then the tool, I'm going to need seven more of those. So I'm going to go ahead and get all this stuff taken care of. I'm probably going to have to go out and get a little bit more resources to finish this up. But I'll bring you back when I'm all marked too. Okay, it is all done. So I'm just going to go ahead and switch that off for now. Uh, probably should have that piggybacked on something else. But anyways, uh, I did get this stuff on. So let's, or made. So let's go ahead and get a new suit, a new pack, and a new tool. Yes, I am a new tool. <laughs> yeah, oop, that's not what I wanted to do. Alright, so that's all turned off. I have made everything I need to get a rover, made some batteries. Uh, I'm going to go a little different style on this one. It's going to try to go solar powered on this. And hopefully we should be good. I was thinking about getting a solar array set up on the ceiling there. Set up on the external battery pack that was separate from the generator. And trying to use that when I could. But that means more mining, more resources I have to get. So uh, we'll just wait till we come back. Alright, so let's go ahead and start building our first vehicle of this series so I am just gonna go with armor block and use a 2x2 two two wherever you are uh, we'll go with the round one just because I will need a battery pack uh, we'll go with the buggy wheel of course and I'm gonna have soap solar panels on it that's a soaked one right yes and that should only take up a two two block space Let's actually check this out. Yes, it does. Oh, it's only one. Really? Huh. Okay, this could be interesting. Let's see how it goes. I actually thought it was like a, a two by three footprint, but it's apparently a one by three. I could probably rotate it. So, uh, let's go ahead with the cockpit. What color are we going to do this thing? We're going to do it. Hmm. I will go red just, cause, just so I don't lose it. Okay, now go ahead and finish it up. Now, for how is my design going to be? I think I was going to have the suspension. Let's make the suspension black. Same with the wheels. I'll we'll make a white in the front. Actually, bring that in a little bit. Um, go with the block keep this red. Actually, let's make a little red pickup. Why not? And, hmm. Sure, we'll do it this way. And then, two, three, four batteries. Actually, no. I want to get some containers on here, too. So the containers are going to go in the back. Uh, where are they here? There they are. I know what I'm doing. I've built in this game before. Uh, let's go five. Why not? Okay, we'll finish them up. Let's actually use the battery so it's faster. 
Uh, that's much better. Uh, block. Two blocks. We'll throw some batteries on there, which was three. Two, three, four, and then two blocks. And then we'll get the suspension on there. We'll go, well, we'll do the other side first before we change colors. Okay, and then battery. Are they going the same way? No, they're not. Actually, let's keep them that way. We'll change the other side. And there we go. So it's going to be like this. I'm going to have the black suspension, black wheels. I'm going to throw the solar panels on the back. And as soon as we're done here, it's actually... Oh, I'm out of electronic parts already. I thought I had more than that. Oh, goody. I get to go look for some carbon. Got two. How many do I need? I don't think I need much. Turn that on. And two of those. I'm actually going to need more for the solar panels, too. Of course. Yes, I need... I actually need to get some more. I'll be back. Okay. Yeah, I uh, was only was only planning on putting four batteries on here, but I ended up putting eight, so that's why I need more. All right, so now for the solar panels. Let's, uh... Hmm, I wonder how I should, we, how I should do this. I'll go like this. Put some more storage on the back, I guess. All right. So these are going to generate 500, and the batteries have storage for 800. Uh, I've noticed too they actually did put the actual power on the battery now, which is good. I still don't know what the other number is, the 120. Uh, maybe that's the maximum amount of power that could be drawn off of them. I'm not too sure. And in the back, let's get let's get a couple more containers. Why not? All right, now for some wheels. I'll go to black. Get, uh, suspension is number four. One there. One there. One off the other side. Oop. There and there. And again, why am I getting different centers of mass on the suspension? That does not make sense. I think it should be on the actual vehicle itself, unless it changes when I unplant it. But we will find it. Alright, now for a switchboard. And where are you? There. And I have no frames. Oh my god, what's this world coming to? Alright, well I gotta turn this back on. And one frame please. Don't need those anymore. Get out, out of there. To it. Come on. I should be able to overclock this thing twice the amount of power to get twice the amount of speed out of it or something. Right, close that. And now that I think about it, I should have made two of these so I can have it properly balanced. Alright, well, I'm going to do that and take care of it and I'll bring you back. Okay, all done. Now, I'm only going to use one of them. I just have it there for balance purposes. I don't think it's going to really matter too much, but I forgot to finish my suspension, too. I'll take care of that in a second. I'm just going to wire everything up. Oh, I guess it helps if I finish the wheels. And the suspension. That's why the center mass thing is showing up. Because nothing's complete. Ugh. And the episode goes on and nobody knows that they saw it. 
They saw it, they just don't know, don't know that they saw it. Anyway. So, as I was saying, let's go ahead and wire up the wheels, which was this one, I do believe. Two, three, and a four. And that was the wrong one. I think I'm connected to the right one. Yes, I forgot to hook up the solar panels, that's why. I might have to wire it up. Is it even charging? I have no idea. Probably not. Alright, well, I gotta jump start this thing. Give me a moment. Okay, she's all charged up, ready to go. I uh, hooked it up on the generator inside here. I turned everything off just so it would charge a little faster. Uh, uh, door's automatic. I gotta close that. And, uh, I can leave that one on. What it is, I actually separated the switchboard. So the one on the right is actually connecting the wheels to the other switchboard, which is everything else. So we go ahead and turn that on. That turns the wheels on. So let's get the tool out and definitely got to increase adjust the suspension here. Let's go right up to max. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, suspension is so so touchy sometimes. And I never did actually configure the wheels. So let's see here. This one's got to go the other way. Oh. Wrong button. Well, oh, right button. Wrong number of times. And then steering. Yes. I think that's right. Yes, it is. All right. So now, now we can drive. So let's uh, let's head off north. And we'll drive by that monument that we see over there. It's not too far away. Uh, I haven't been this direction, so I don't have to worry about any holes. Uh, it's gonna be a, a bit of a tight fit. Let's see what we can find here. First sign of cobalt, though. Whoa. I heard they changed that, too, with the cockpits, that you can't breathe underwater anymore. So we do have to be a little careful. Oh, I'm not getting through here, either. We're going to have to go this way. Let's go to Sturb the Brand Nest, shall we? I'm coming for you. Yeah, you can see we take the nest right out. Bang! Now that I think about it, I probably should have left them there so we can have fun with them later. Well, let's go see what we have here. I was actually thinking about setting up a big beacon before I left, but then we'd have to have power for it. And I spent all my resources on this little red devil here. And I don't actually want to go that way. It's... Don't tell me it's out of power already. Yeah. I wonder if these guys are going to repopulate. I came out and took uh, took out the only... Oh, geez, there's lots of them. Never mind. Came out and took a couple of alpha males. Got uh, 15 pieces of meat out of it. Oh, and look at it. It's our dear old pals of Ludillos. Oh, a lot of them here. We're going to have to get a tank made soon. Oh wow, but a tank is going to be super expensive to make. Because I need hover pads for that. Is that cobalt? No, that's silicone. Yeah, it might be a little ways yet till I come across some, so I'll keep on trucking along and I'll bring you back when I find something. So, I've come across a bit of a terrain change here, and this uh, kind of looks like familiar territory. So, let's go up here, see if we can find any cobalt rocks. This might actually be it. Probably silicone. Yeah, silicone. And it's probably going to be the same thing, too. Yeah, silicone. So, we might have to go a little further north. 
Jeffy won't be hanging around here, so yeah, I'll bring you back. So I've been going at this for about 20 minutes now, and I think I'm definitely getting into the area. Because this is actually aluminum here. I already got some, uh, something else already, but silver, that's what it was, aluminum and silver. Uh, I think I see some cobalt over the hill, but I do have to be careful. I've been seeing the salamanders here. And yes, right there, but I think they're guarding the cobalt. I think I'm sitting too high up to run them over. Well, I'll try it anyways. You never know. And you know, we can run over them. We can't run them over. But we are definitely somewhere in the area of what we're looking for. That's a new plant I haven't seen. But let's go around and see what we can find. It started getting a little swampy around here, so there was a definite, definite biome change. But it was more gradual, and that's just because I got a larger planet size right now. But it's weird, I haven't been seeing any beacons or wrecks. Oh, and that's what I'm looking for right there. Nobody around? Alright. Let's get out. Let's get out of the first per third person too. Cobalt. Yeah. That's what I'm looking for right there. At least I think that's what I'm looking for. Best thing about this game is when somebody's attacking you, at least you get the music. Aluminum and silver. Okay. Feel like a go Groundhog some days. Pop my head out of the hole. See if anybody's coming. Or I can just go in the third person and go the old cheaty zoom out. Anyways, let's just see what else we're gonna find. Not really too worried about the aluminum. I do need it, but it's cobalt that I'm more worried about. Because once I can get those miners going, then you can always find that spot that gives you the one or two percent or whatever and go from there. Uh, let's see what we have besides a whole bunch of beetles, brands, or whatever you want to call them. I call them a pain in the ass. I gotta admit, this little rover's been pretty good. I adjusted the torque sitting on the front wheels, sent the torque, and I don't know if you can see it. I went over one of these mountain ranges. <laughs> I just decided to go straight up instead of going around. I did get stuck, and I went to go build a winch, but. I didn't have enough to, uh, I couldn't actually build the mechanical parts. Ah, that thing's here. Oh, there's cobalt everywhere, look at this. And we found a distress signal. Okay, is it safe? Yes, it is. Keep it secret, keep it safe. And cobalt, yay. Keep recording just in case something attacks me. Aluminum too, I actually need that. I'll clean up a few rocks. I don't really think that was cobalt, that was silicone. 33 carp cobalt, nice. I'm gonna see if I can get a stack and then we'll start working our merry way back. Yeah, definitely being careful. Yeah, silicone, don't need that. Wasn't there one up here? I think that was. Yes, right over there. More silicone. I don't want silicone, I want cobalt. Just because it's blue doesn't mean it's the same thing. Okay, I've got a few more over here. If we check these out. Oh wow, I've never seen yellow versions of these guys. Oh, and that was actually a salamander, not a piece of cobalt. Alright. There's a piece right there. Right next to the fireflies. Well... I think I can take out the fireflies. Alright, and... Alright, 
They're gone. Okay, uh, have a little bit of water. Get back in here. And see what else we can find. Look for a little bit more. Uh, that's not what I'm looking for. These things, I don't like those things. Ooh, this is a nasty area. Squish. Did I kill it? No. Tough little buggers. My god, this rain is horrid. I think that's a big chunk over here. I think so. The only thing about it when it rains in this game, no. The only thing about this game when it rains is everything is so washed out in color, so you. It's kind of hard to tell the difference between cobalt and aluminum sometimes. What do we got here? More fireflies, I'll leave them be. Yeah, it doesn't look like too much. But the important thing is, is I got cobalt. It only takes two cobalt to make a reinforced plate. And I got enough for about 20 plates, which is great. That's going to get us started. Alright, so now the long journey home. I have no idea where I'm going. Aw, oh, look at the little guy. Aw. Oh. Oh, that's what you get for letting kids play in the street. You're a different color. You're an outcast? Or are you the Alpha Gudillo? I don't know. But anyways, uh, uh, that's where we started. Way over here. So I gotta turn to the right a little bit. And hit the right button to get out of the map. So I guess I'm heading this way. Yes, eventually. So yeah, I'll bring you back uh, when I'm when I'm home. Maybe uh, we'll check out that monument on the way too. So I'll see you soon. Okay, according to my HUD, there's supposed to be a monument here. Uh, it's coming over from this direction here, and I saw it. And I came up the hill and it disappeared. So I don't know what happened. I don't see a sign of a teleporter. I don't see a sign of anything. As you can see, it's supposed to be right here. But nothing. I still got a kilometer away to go to get back to the base. But let's go up top of this hill here and just see what's going on. Probably should have put some lights on this thing, but... Whatever. Uh, come on, girl, you can make it. You can make it. No, I saw it. It was that one that uh, had the it was curved and had the tip to it, or not the tip, sort of like a point at the top. That's a shame. My first monument it disappears on me, glitches out. Anyway, I'll bring you back when I'm when I'm back home. Okay, I am back just in time for daytime. I uh, had a little bit of running with a small pond and almost got stuck. But now, with the reconnection of this, if I get out, it reconnects. Alright, so what do I have on me? I have my cobalt. Yay! Cobalt. Alright, let's get this in here. Let's fire this bad boy up. And let's see what we can do here. Silver, I thought it was titanium. Okay, so we need these. Go ahead and craft that. Uh, don't need anything in here. Uh, we need room for the refinery. What's in here? You know, take that out. And I'll have to put another one in here. Oh, it's on seven. Okay. Uh, I'll just make them all green, why not? And, give
use those two of those if I actually take them out. And now for the refinery, which is already up. Alright, refinery, we're gonna make. Make a bright yellow. Frames. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, fine, make me a frame. Let's move that up ahead. Take a few seconds. I'm probably gonna just take the shackle off my rover, but whatever. Okay. Oh, four of them. Fine. Four of them. And we have pretty much everything else unlocked. Alright, so this is just 20 clean wa purified water. Uh, we're gonna get an excess amount of carbon through the miners. Uh, that is... Titanium and Xanite. Alright, this is a new thing for me. Sadly, that monument didn't actually load, so <laughs> what good is that to me? And then we got a Uranium and a Deuterium, but that means we have now have absolutely everything unlocked. All we have to do is just build one conveyor, and it is this one right here. Frames, come on. Don't do this to me. Not on camera. Mechanical parts, of course. Uh, I need one more. Uh, I don't have any elsewhere, do I? No. Uh, I'll just take a few seconds. And there we go. So now what does that give us? Uh, the medium food and drink machine. Yes, that's actually a good idea. Which is this one. What do I need for it? Reinforced frames. Okay, that's not happening because I know that's Xanite. Alright, what do we got here? Tight aluminum. Oh, I can make them. Alright, what does it need? It needs two and three circuits. Let me get everything ready here and I'll bring you back. All right, I have everything. Uh, what are we gonna make? Color? We're gonna make this thing. Now oh, keep it white. Why not? Does this have a conveyor? Yes, it does. One at each end. That's okay. This is just temporary, anyways, because this is just gonna be a place to live. Because we got all this room somewhere around here. Oh, it's in the back there. Oh, and that's not a safe. Or something. Anyways, uh, ooh, Is that pink thing. Oh, that was uh, special electrolyte water. That's not too bad. A little pricey. And then we had the superfood. Superfood. That's why I didn't cook all my meat. And water was the same price. Okay, so let's go ahead and. So shut that off for now. I do believe I have everything I need for a miner. I want to take a miner, a solar panel. Uh, 200 on the miner, solar panel does 250. So three batteries, solar panels, and conveyors. Uh, let me see what I have. All right. Uh, let me get a few things ready, I think. Let me just double check. Okay, so I have everything set up, uh, made for miner, three batteries, uh, switchboard, and solar panels. I'm not gonna place everything down right away. I just wanna do some testing and, you know, like even the place just like right here. You never know what this is gonna be. And the best thing is this thing actually can be run off a solar panel, which is great. So let's go ahead and place that. I'm going to place solar panel. Let's put that here for now. Connect that. I'll build that. Build that. And, and what do we have? Iron and carbon. All right. 
So now we go check the next spot. Hopefully it's going to be something close. Uh, I did head north last time, so maybe maybe a little further south. Usually where the biome changes a little bit. Uh, let's go grab the buggy. Nah, I should do a little bit of exploring around. I'll bring you back if I ever, f when I find something. So I found what I was looking for. This is from what I recall. This is actually going to get you like a little tiny bit of everything. Uh, about 1.2 kilometers away right now, so it's not exactly that far, but not that close either. And I just want to make sure I'm out of their out of their range. So let's go ahead and drop a miner down. Place that up there. And I'm getting smart about it. Instead of actually placing down the solar panel, I'm just hooking it right up to the right up to the truck here. And there we go. That's exactly what I'm looking for. Alright, so uh, let's go ahead and get our solar panel down. Uh, which way is the sun heading right now? Oh, perfect. Sun's on this side. So, I'll go ahead and place the solar panel there. And I'll place three batteries. One, two, three. Why am I missing composites? What? I don't have anything in here, do I? Ah, whatever. I'll take that one. Uh, also spare battery. Okay, that kind of scared me there. Alright, now switchboard, which is number four. Yeah, and connect it all up. Uh, why? Oh. Uh huh. That's why. Okay, so. Throw a couple of containers on top. I'm gonna have to sacrifice some parts off my truck for this, but. It's for a good cause. Now this one here, I am just gonna have set to things that I don't get over at the base. So we'll take iron off, carbon off, silicone off, take the xanite, and we'll take everything else. And I'll we'll put one more container on there just for the sake of it, because it will fill up pretty quick. All right, I'm gonna snag a battery off the other side here. All right, which one did I take off? Uh, this one. Okay, I didn't know if the frame was still there or not. All right, uh, that's not a container. No, it's not. That's a container. Fine. Oh, I could have taken these off. Since there was nothing in there anyways. Alright. Alright, now let's make a color for this. All this stuff so I can easily see it. Let's go with red. Why not? Okay, so... We already have a little bit of xanite, aluminum, and carbon, which has been blacklisted. And there we go. So that's going to continue going. And I'm going to head get going because while that's going, I'm going to go get another one set up at the uh, at the home base. Oh, jeez, that's actually something I forgot. What's the point of dropping a miner if I'm going to lose it? Let's get out of here. Uh, so that we can. Um, where is that? Eight. Okay, I got, got the frame. Do I have everything else? I do. Okay, oops, that's the wrong button. 
Uh, navigation, and we're going to make this F, 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 F. You remember F, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Alright, so that's good. Now, get back into third person, and head home. Okay, I am back, and guess what? Some idiot left the power on. That was me. I'm that idiot. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, at least it didn't burn through too much power. Did that actually reconnect? It did, wow. Well, I guess I should have known. Anyway, so that is going to be pretty much it. I'm going to dump a miner down somewhere. Actually, let's go do that right now. Uh, do I have enough parts for it? Uh, two reinforced frames. I thought I did. I guess I don't. I made just enough for that. Oh, yeah, I made this thing too, I think. Or something. Oh, yeah, the refinery. Uh, yeah, anyways, I'm going to go get a, get a few more things set up. Get another miner drop down here somewhere to get us some art. Some of the uh, the common stuff, and we'll go from there. Uh, I think next episode, I since I do have some cobalt here. Uh, in here somewhere, yes. That I should be able to get some sort of flyer, so at least we can go back and forth to the the F mine over there and get some more resources going. But anyways, uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a like, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.